Good afternoon, beautiful love bugs. Uh, welcome back, honey, to another video. <laughs> Happy Halloween Collective. Yeah, the moon is in Scorpio. The sun is in Scorpio. Jupiter is in Taurus. Mars is currently in Gemini. Yes. Collective. A lot of powerful energy at this time. Yeah, make sure that you're doing some self-care, okay? Taking care of yourself, loving on yourself, treating yourself. You deserve it. So let's just go ahead and dive into this message. Remember that the message is general. There's something about your brother, okay? Okay, he could be calling you. You guys could be getting ready to hang out. Or uh, something like that regarding your brother here, okay? So let's go ahead and dive into this message. Overall energy, uh, yeah, we got an emperor energy. I'm just saying, your brother, there's uh, a brother figure here. Okay, we got the two of wands mm, next to the strength. So what's going on with this emperor energy today? Mm. Yeah. Mm. Hmm. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. This emperor with the two of wands next to the strength and the page of pentacles with the two of swords. Mm. Is he trying to block you here? Is he obstructing you here? Uh, has he been fake, too fake and two-faced towards you here? Hey, the possibility is always real. There's some sort of drama. The Five of Wands lets us know it. So this emperor, okay, who could be your brother. There's somebody's brother, okay, father figure. There's a masculine energy here. They could be a Leo. They could be Scorpio, Aries energy here. Okay, nonetheless, there's some sort of... There's some sort of conflict regarding this person or because of this person. Yeah. Mm. Somebody could be trying to block this emperor, okay? You could be the emperor that somebody is trying to block. You could be a gifted uh, masculine energy here that someone is trying to block. This could be your own damn brother here, okay? Jealous of your gifts is here. Some sort of family discord or conflict is here. Take the message, how it resonates. This brother could be a friend of yours, okay? Somebody you thought you guys were cool. You, you could have thought that, you know, you guys were cool. The whole time this motherfucker's secretly jealous and envious of you type of energy is here. We got the page of wands. So you're not in contact with this person. You could be a masculine energy here uh, that has a, a, a brother, some sort of masculine energy here that is at a distance from you or there's some sort of discord regarding you in this particular brother figure here okay they're at a distance from you uh you haven't seen them you don't talk to them you're not in communications with them but they've been keeping up some mess behind the scenes it's here yeah we got the queen of wands mm. Mm, mm, mm. so we got the strength energy the nine of pentacles here with the queen of wands yeah this person is jealous of a connection that you're in here or the beautiful lady that you're dating here. You got your eye on here. It's possible. Weird. This is kind of like weird ass energy here. We got the nine of wands here with the star energy. Wow. It's a lot of fire energy here. Damn. We got the nine of wands. Mm. So I'm getting some sort of corrupt father figure here. Um, who could happen to be your brother? This person has been trying to cause some sort of conflict. Possibly jealous of the fact that you are gifted. Okay? Wow. This doesn't necessarily have to be your brother, but they are somebody's brother. They're trying to block a relationship that you got here. Okay, you could be a masculine watching this. Okay, I'm getting a man here. Yeah. That's what I got here. There's some sort of... Uh, there's a masculine energy trying to block this uh, emperor who could be in an upright. They got some sort of masculine energy that's been trying to cause some sort of discord for sure. Trying to block something regarding this 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 emperor in the uprights. Okay, there's a betrayal here. Damn, we got the five of swords. 
What in the world is this? Mm -mm. We got this King of Pentacles. Wow. So, yeah, it's because of a lady here. It's because of this Empress. Somebody is jealous that this Emperor in the upright has... Um, he's married the love of his life. She's an empress. She's beautiful. She's an entertainer. She's successful. She's prominent. It's here. Uh, somebody's hating on this, this emperor in the upright for sure. They're hating on him. Trying to block him. There's a betrayal here. Mm. You could be a masculine. Uh, you could be the emperor that's in the upright that's been betrayed by your brother, your friend, okay, a family member, your homie, okay, somebody that you, you were cool with or you thought was cool take the message how it resonates there's something about Master P okay he may be your favorite entrepreneur rapper entertainer uh, yeah very successful uh, energy right there my goodness so yeah this is kind of like Kane kill Abel was it Kane kill Abel type of energy here uh Somebody's jealous of this emperor in the uprights position in life. This destiny here. Yeah, this destiny that includes this empress here. Period. The emperor the emperor in the upright is the king of bonds. Star energy. Fated to marry a specific uh, woman here. The energy is here. There's some sort of jealousy regarding that situation for sure. For sure, for sure, for sure. Look, the devil with the six of wands. Uh-uh. There's a brother energy here uh, that could be a narcissist here. That's uh, in devil energy here. Yeah. Mm. Causing injustice with the justice energy. This is being exposed. This is being exposed here. We got the six of swords here. It's spiritual here. Period. With the knot of... Wow, somebody's been hiding. Um, there's a brother energy that's been hiding their true, true, true motives true intentions towards this emperor in the upright for sure for sure this emperor in the upright could be a divine masculine he's globally known here it's possible mm. it's possible he may be meant to be with an empress that is globally known okay somebody's jealous of this emperor this divine masculine okay he's the emperor in the upright here this could be like his best friend. You know what I'm saying? Somebody he grew up with. Somebody he thought, you know what? You know, he could have thought they were cool. This 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 brother figure uh, is operating uh, out of devil energy behind the scenes. Trying to cause some sort of blockages to his upgrades currently. Yeah, we got the blockage energy with the two of swords. Divine masculine emperor in the upright with the page of pentacles. Could be a gifted... Um, shaman okay amazing spiritual gifts and talents there's some sort of betrayal here with the ten of swords pretty brutal with the five of swords so this brother figure is hating on this divine masculine for sure heavy heavy heavily with the strength card here wow he feels some type of way about this divine masculine who's the emperor in the upright he feels some type of way about his success here it's possible Yep. So this brother figure who's hating on this emperor, uh, this emperor who happens to be divine masculine, by the way. Yeah, he's a knight of wands. So this emperor that's hating on him is a knight of wands. He's jealous of divine masculine for sure. Trying to block him. He betrayed him. There's a betrayal here. Okay. This doesn't have to be a man that's a brother. This could be a female in, in masculine energy. The possibility is there, but I got a masculine here. It's spiritual with the Six of Swords. The sun energy is exposing it. The justice energy says, yes, that's correct. There's some sort of deception regarding somebody that's uh, affiliated, associated, associated with or known to a divine masculine. Okay, period. He's the emperor in the upright here today, period. There's some sort of devil energy. I see that this, uh, this guy is jealous of this emperor because of this divine feminine. That's one one thing that I see here for sure yeah yep this is what I see we got the fool next to the lovers period and a nine of cups Ooh. 
he could want this empress for himself. <laughs> he want this empress. He want divine feminine. He want her. Divine masculine, this, this brother of yours, this relative of yours, this friend of yours, um, this old colleague of yours, this childhood friend, this old acquaintance of yours, they're kind of jealous of the empress that you're with, the empress that you have told them about, the empress that you got your eye on, or the fact that you got an empress. My goodness. <laughs> this person is, is, is low-key jealous of that. They're a knight of wands. Divine masculine could be attractive. It may not be, he may, he may not, it may not be much of an effort for him to attract women. Okay. Yeah, he may not be promiscuous. He might, he, he may have went through a period where he was, and we can't say that he, he's truly not. There's something that this, this, this brother figure is envious of here for sure. He's for, for sure jealous of this connection that this divine masculine has with this divine feminine. It's undeniable here. Period. They could work together here. These, these, this divine masculine and this brother figure here, with the hair front being here and the three of pentacles. That's like a, a a colleague. Okay, this could be somebody that works together. They belong to some sort of organization together. They are affiliated through some sort of work. Okay, that's how they know each other. I see the five of pentacles twice. Wow. Hmm. There's a heavy collaborative effort here to cause, to cause Divine Masculine to be in the Five of Pentacles energy. This is somebody that he's, he knows that is hating on him, bro. Possibly wanting him to be uh, outcast, cast out, or ostracized uh, from his work, from, from this group, from this affiliation here. He's seething with anger and jealousy towards him. Okay? And these type of people cannot be underestimated. <laughs> they can't be. That's the honest to God truth. And yeah, this brother figure is the guilty one. They're in a judgment. Their health could be failing here. Wow, this could be same sex as well. Period. We got balance and imagination and relationships. <sighs> and abundance. This this brother figure is certainly jealous of this abundant connection that Divine Masculine is he's in with his Divine feminine, okay? Wow. He this man could secretly want divine masculine. The energy is here. He don't know that his friend is gay, bisexual, or has some sort of desire for him. Or once again, this could be same sex. The energy is here. Period. Mm hmm This could be some sort of relationship that they've been in. There's some sort of discord because divine masculine uh has moved on or he has uh mm, he has an interest in someone else now who happens to be an empress. Empress, The empress energy could be male or female, period. Take the message how it resonates. We got growth and patience. There's there's a masculine energy that has a sexual interest in this divine masculine. This could be his friend, once again, somebody that he works with, somebody that he's affiliated with, or somebody he crossed paths with, he met, he know of, okay? This masculine energy, once again, also, okay, also, he could be jealous of this empress energy. He wants the empress energy. Okay, he may he may want the empress and the emperor energy. Okay, some sort of sick-ass uh, brother figure, brother masculine energy type of vibe. He's jealous that this divine masculine gets to be with this divine feminine. And you know what? It, it makes him... Uh, his jealousy is causing him to do some bad stuff behind the scenes to cause some sort of discord regarding the union with these two. Take the message how it resonates. Period. This dude is sick, bro. He's sick, okay? So he's either this brother figure, this male figure, this low vibrational corrupt father figure, we'll call him. Okay, he, he, he could have some sort of interest in the divine feminine and you know what? Divine feminine has moved on. She doesn't even know that this person exists on this plane at this time she's in a marriage she's in a connection she has her eye on somebody else this corrupt father figure low vibing individual here okay is jealous of divine feminist divine masculine the energy is here the energy is here sweet love bug uh-huh 
secretly trying to uh, block this divine masculine from his union with his divine feminine. The energy is here. Period. Mm -hmm. So that's what I got here. It's definitely a strong indication of same-sex energy here. Wow. It's here. Take what you need from the message, honey, and just leave the rest. Take what you need from these messages and leave the rest. Dang. This is some sort of... This could be like Divine Feminine's weird-ass, sick-ass ex who's been obsessed with destroying and ruining her life. Okay? He's attracted to Divine Feminine's Divine Masculine. Okay? It's here. <laughs> the possibility is certainly real. Okay? Yeah. Take the message how it resonates. Divine masculine, not gay. That's always a real possibility, too, honey. We got the Ten of Wands, uh huh, with the Three of Pentacles energy. So, this low vibing brother figure, corrupt father figure, has been trying to put the Ten of Wands on this connection between the Emperor and the Empress. Yep. Possibly utilizing the assistance and the aid of some sort of group with the Hierophant, the cause of instability. With the five of pentacles here my goodness this person is foolish yep trying to cause some sort of instability regarding these divine lovers here we got the emperor and the empress king of wands queen of wands on the board here period there's some sort of separation these two are in separation currently the possibility is here the devil with the six of wands this narcissistic low vibrational brother father corrupt father figure energy is trying to keep them in some sort of separated type of state He's lusting over divine feminine, lusting over divine masculine, lusting over them both. Could be a bisexual gay man here. Or some man that's, yeah, gay that wants divine feminine's divine masculine. That energy is here, period. We got the sun energy, uh-huh, with the six of swords next to the knight of pentacles. Mm -hmm. Waging some sort of spiritual war, spiritual warfare is here. The queen and the king of pentacles, these two are... Divine feminine, divine ma uh, masculine are uh, heavily um, cloaked, okay? Period. They're matching pretty, pretty strong here today. The emperor, the empress, the, qu the queen of wands, the king of wands, they're both single with the nine of pentacles. They're in separation here with the three of wands, period. There's some sort of attempt to keep them in some sort of separated type of states with the six of swords. Some sort of battle here with the five of swords. There's a heavy betrayal here, period. That's what I got. So this corrupt father figure, this could be divine feminist brother. Okay, there's there's a brother figure here. They somebody damn brother. They been caught blocking here, big time, moving in silence. They getting some sort of bad karma. They could be hooked on divine feminine, hooked on her life in such a way that is that would be deemed sickly. Okay, mm-hmm. Possibly uh. The last five to six months, this corrupt, low-vibing father figure uh, has been doing a lot of heavy spell work to keep these two in some sort of separated type of states. This is low down, dirty, and shameful. Uh, what this low-vibing karmic masculine uh, has been doing behind the scenes, period. He's having a hard time getting it through his head uh, that no means no. Divine Feminine don't want you. This could be Divine Masculine, too. He's moved on from this connection regarding this person. Okay, they're trying to make Divine Masculine's life a living hell. Trying to block his purpose, which would include his Divine Lover, uh, his Divine Empress, his Divine Soulmate. Divine Masculine is being called to forgive. Forgive your enemies. Divine Feminine and Divine Masculine energy are here. I got, I got a straight couple here that has some sort of bisexual man that has an interest and possibly both of them. Okay. Oh boy, this is some weird ass energy. Weird, weird, weird energy collective. Mm. Once again, this could be somebody divine masculine. No, bro. These are bros. This bro is secretly envious of divine masculine. Okay. His love life, his lover, his love interests. It's here. This low vibing, uh, old acquaintance, father figure, corrupt figure, brother figure, he's failed to interrupt something regarding this connection. What's meant to be, will be. 
trust that. Okay, yep. So I don't know what this is, Collective. Take what you need from this message. It's strange as fuck, okay? It's strange as fuck. Divine Masculine, is, he's very gorgeous, okay? Very handsome. Very, very, very beautiful man. Okay? Women want him, men want him. Okay, Divine Feminine, too. She's a very beautiful, gorgeous woman. Women want her, men want her, okay? Yep, they both uh, are irresistible, okay? Irresistible, beautiful, beautiful uh, specimens, okay? Gorgeous. That's just the honest to God truth, period. There's no doubt about it. You may love Gwen, St Gwen Stefani, okay? You may love to sing in group, no doubts, period. You could be a comedian. Your divine masculine could be a comedian, period. Divine feminine got... Um, She's the woman with the uh, the golden womb type of energy, okay? She can make a man uh, come to his knees, baby. That's the energy, quite literally, drop to his knees, okay? And, and not in an aggressive type of way, just her tenderness and her femininity and, and the way she loves is so tender and caring, okay? She make men surrender here. She can do it. She don't even have to try. They, they, inevitably, they inevitably go through some sort of go through some sort of transformative experience or situation situationship by, by being with her. You see the death energy. Okay, it's time to level up. It's time to level up. It's time to grow up. Okay, period. It's kind of like she reached the deepest parts of her lover's soul here. Okay, she 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 reaches down in there and grabs hold of the, grabs hold of him and okay awakens him. Period. This could be your ex divine feminine. That's he's missing that type of love. Period. He's in some sort of regret here. He's imagined all type of ways that he could be destructive. It's here. A lot of sex magic your ex could have been doing on you, Divine Feminine. Dang. He was in his ego when he was dealing with you. He didn't know what he had when he had you. Now he's in some sort of grief uh, without you. You're happy. <laughs> You're free. Period. You're successful. Highly abundant. You got a good connection here with your Divine Masculine. There's... There's no confusion about it. Yep, there's some sort of balance here that's that you bring to each other here. You you uplift him, he uplifts you. She uplifts you, you uplift him. Divine feminine, divine masculine energy. This could be like a high level soulmate of yours. Your divine masculine, your divine feminine. Okay. Yes. Your soulmate loves, accepts, and respects you unconditionally. They accept you. You see, you got an ex that didn't accept you. They want a second chance. It's here. Or something like that. Yeah, they have some sort of confusion or something going on regarding them. It was just not going to be something that was going to be meant to be. That's what I got here. Mm-hmm. When I see this health energy and I see the judgment... I feel like this could be your ex and, and, and their soul and their spirit. Okay, something ain't right. How they how they gonna win when they're not right within? Okay? They're the they're the one that's the guilty party here. They've been conspiring to break up your union for a long ass time here. I feel like this could be divine feminine's ex. And hey, they could even know your divine masculine type of energy. Stranger things have happened, okay? There's some sort of... There could be some sort of connection there. Take the message how it resonates. Divine Feminine. There definitely could be some sort of connection there. Mm. Wow. This act, this... I'm hearing he's an asshole. Your ex. They lack empathy. They're a narcissist. They don't have empathy. Okay, we got this fear energy. Hmm. <clears throat> they were scared to embrace love or... They're a narc. They don't have love to give. They need to accept who the fuck they are and move the fuck around type of energy. Period. Mm-hmm. We got, we got friendship and perseverance and forgiveness. Forgive your enemies. Yep. Collective, I'm going to leave it here. God bless.